Hello everyone, uh, welcome back to Freedom City 1165. This is in Surviving Mars Below and Beyond. Now for those of you tuning into the series late, it's basically a maximum difficulty run uh, with Below and Beyond that is uh, maximum difficulty rating of 1165%. Uh, with the added extra difficulty of having no rival colonies at the start. I did, however, get a event uh, relatively early on, earlier than I would have expected, where we got uh, a new colony set up. And we actually benefited quite, quite strongly from that, even though it was a bit painful in the short term. Right. So, where are we now? Well, we have a cold wave. And uh, that is, well, it's a cold wave, so, you know, uh, it's not the end of the world, but it's a cold wave. Uh, we just triggered a, uh, well, let's check in on the, the mission thing here. Uh, we've actually uh, achieved four out of five uh, uh, goals, uh, sponsor goals, uh, mission goals. Um and the land of colonists on Mars by Sol 15, that's the hard one in under the um, uh, Paradox sponsor. Uh, the reward is, yeah, we've used the reward, but it's not all that brilliant. Um, uh, the two research two breakthroughs and nine breakthroughs, those are pretty straightforward. You're going to be researching breakthroughs anyway. Analyzing uh, map anomalies, again, not terribly difficult, just takes time. Uh, constructing a megadome, well, uh, that we can do at our leisure, right? And the reward, again, is not brilliant, but it's not nothing. So, that, uh, uh, so we're going to get a complete slate of uh, sponsor, uh, sponsor goals here, and that's, uh, that's somewhat unusual. Normally, when I play a maximum difficulty run, I don't bother with this one. Um, right, and uh, you can see here all of the uh, rules that we have enabled, uh, all of these here. Uh, those are all the ones that add to the difficulty level, and uh, I think Tech Variety does. One of them I don't think does, but it does make things a little less uh, predictable. So, um... Yeah, uh, that's um, that's basically that. Uh, you can see it's at 41 degrees north, uh, 111 degrees west, uh, or 111 if you prefer. Uh, right. Uh, okay, so that's enough of that. Uh, now, where are we at here? So we have a decent amount of polymers. We are producing machine parts at a uh, surplus rate. Uh, we're producing those at a surplus rate. We have um, nano uh, refinement or extraction or whatever it is. So, so we are able to, I built these uh, while there was a uh, rare metals deposit here. Uh, they will continue to operate at a substantially reduced uh, rate while there is, uh, you know, like, like, well, even while there's no deposit there. And that's, um, that's kind of good, actually. Uh, that's a useful breakthrough, and I was quite pleased to get it. Uh, now, the other thing that I was, okay, concrete supplies. Um, okay, yeah, we're, we're producing concrete at a decent rate now. Uh, food, uh, we're producing lots of uh lots of food okay uh we have lots of uh, rare metals uh okay let's take a look here we could export another batch of rare metals um actually i want to check in up here uh we don't have a safari uh do we have botanists that's resources is that worth uh doing uh that one is engineers that's new techs. Eh, new techs might be worth uh, sending. We do have the engineers now. Let's uh, let's send an expedition. We'll also get the uh, time moving. 
Right. Um, we also have enough to get a uh, rocket that we can send to um, uh, the asteroids, right? Um, okay, now, metals. We are producing 27, and we need 20. Yeah, we probably want more metals production. Um, again, we've got the same thing here with the... Um, uh, deposit that's been uh, uh, worked out. Uh, what I can do, however... Oh, uh, what text did we get? Resilient architecture, underground psych studies, Project Mohol. Aha! Uh, Martian-born strength. Okay, let's open the research screen. Martian-born strength. Okay, yeah, that's useful. Okay, we, pro we really want to build the Omega Telescope, but it's expensive. Same with Mohol. Um, resilient architecture. Okay, that's potentially useful. Now, we could build... We do have the Megadome research, right? Yeah, we could build the Megadome and complete the sponsor goals. Um, space Mirror. Uh... Underground Psych Studies, okay, right. We are researching Greenhouse Mars, so we can make a GHG factory. Yeah. Uh, Self-sufficient lighting is going to be useful for underground stuff. Um, uh, supportive community, that would be good. General training, that would be good. Okay. Uh, okay. So, uh, realistically, I probably want to be uh, working this deposit here. Uh, so, uh, what I'm going to do is go in here, metals extractor, put a couple of them here, and I think, yeah, that'll be fine. Uh, we'll build those. Oh, we're going to need power to them as well. Uh, power cable. Do that. That should connect it. Yep. Uh, we do have the uh, the resources to do that. Oh, we should land the rocket too. Yeah, that'd be good. Get our uh, people back, right? Um... Okay, what have we got down here? We've got... Uh, oh yeah, we're, we're waiting for concrete to come in, right? Okay, so we got one of those up. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn these off. Okay. Uh, and with this one uh, running, uh, two shifts, full out. Uh, we'll put Amplify on. Uh, this guy, uh, we can get him out here to the point where this one uh, is not on cold ground. Okay. Good. So we've got a uh, full full uh, operation going there. We're producing 7.7 .7 there. Um, yep, that's good. Uh, where, where the, well, well, let's check in on the, the scanning. Uh, yeah, we'll get that. Yeah. Okay. Uh, drop in here. Okay, we've got five saws left on the cold wave. This guy frozen. Hmm. Uh, what if I do that? Uh, right. Okay. It has power. Uh, right. Um, okay. So I need to... I need to get 
uh, additional power down here. Uh, and I think the way to do it is with another one of these. Because they just take concrete and machine parts, which we have. Um, right. Do you have... You have the upgrade, right? No. You don't. Okay. Well, we'll, we'll let um, that build. And... Auto save, and then we'll, uh, let's see, there we go, now we'll build the upgrade, and that should mean that all of our stuff over here, once the upgrades come in, have enough power, um, you, um, okay, if I do that, also do that. Yep. Okay. So that means... Yeah, okay. Good. Um... Hmm. We're running out of power up here, too. Uh, on this grid, right? Yeah, we are. So we need, we're 64 short. Um, I could build. A few of those. Yeah. Yeah, I'll do that. Um, Yeah, I think hopefully... Oh, and this... Oh, it's off at night. Okay. Um, are we actually building anything here? Oh, yeah, we are. Good. Okay. There's another one going up. Yep. So, these guys are actually uh, reasonably useful uh, in that, uh, you know, they produce a decent amount of power. The maintenance for them is basically the same as the small turbines uh, per um, uh, power, uh, which is what makes them, which makes them, uh, you know, worth it. Uh, but they, they are uh, less maintenance for the same power, basically. Uh, I believe. Or, or like less um, maintenance tasks. Um, okay. Well, that's got us to 19 power positive in the uh, night. Okay. Good. That That is good. Um... So that should should get us through the cold wave, unless this turns into a long winter event. Uh, the long winter event is seriously annoying. Um, okay. Um, okay, so we are now producing uh, nine metals, apparently. Uh, lack of power, apparently. Um, the transport is, um, yeah. Well, I think maybe I should make another one of these. Down here, yeah. Okay, that should, Yeah, because we're just short uh, a little bit of power here. Right, okay. Uh, I think also it might be worth putting a... Uh, no, it's in here. Uh, a couple of living quarters down here. 
Uh, just like so. Yeah. Uh, okay. Colonist has gone mad. You are a renegade. Uh, okay. Good. Um, because it was in this dome, it was fine. Uh, right. Okay, now down here, we have... Uh, you need your upgrade. Uh, right. Uh, right, 7, 8.8, .8, yeah. Okay. And you are... You have no people in you yet? Okay. But we have somewhere to uh, let them uh, operate. Now, uh, let's um, check in over here. Right. Uh, we need our guy over here to come over here. And what do we got here? We got polymers all up over here. Okay. What, what are you carrying? Metals. Okay. Uh, right. That's good. Uh, okay. I think it might be useful to, uh, turn on exports here. Yeah, because we have 55 of these, so, uh, I can go ahead and let that, uh, that load up, uh, and send it, and we go, what? Oh, the explorer is uh, hurt as well. No, we're going to go in here. Cargo rocket. Uh, what? We could bring a little bit of stuff with us if, uh, you know, it would be useful. Actually, we could bring a safari. What prefabs do we have in here? Anything useful? Not really. Okay, but we could bring a safari just for that thing there. Yeah, yeah, we could bring a safari. Uh, right. Yeah, I think that's worth doing. Um, Let's just bring a few of those just for uh, giggles. Okay. Launch. Good. Uh, now we have Greenhouse Mars. Um, right. Um, okay. Uh, you are where? You have arrived over here. Uh, you are going to fix the uh, rover, right? Off it goes. Then we go over here, send you over here, and we'll fix the explorer. Yep, that would be uh, useful. Um, and I think maybe I'll start running some asteroid um, uh, or yeah, meteor missions. Yeah. Uh, that might be useful. Um, maybe do some uh, ice asteroids too, ultimately. Ooh. Pause. Uh, no, I want to grab one of you. Dump you there. Um, one of you, dump you there, and, yeah, okay, so we've, we've fixed that guy, um, okay, uh, we can send him back over here, yeah. Okay, and you are an explorer. Yeah, 
send you back over here maybe no I could send you up here where where I've also got meteor protection right what oh we've got frozen stuff over here right so we don't have meteor protection up there but uh, yeah uh, are you do you have any drones um, you assign okay repair that repair that okay now we no 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 um no we uh you no don't use the elevator um a sign there okay yeah so if we have one of those assigned there are you uh you're not frozen okay good oh you are frozen okay so we have power over there. And now we have... This guy is frozen. Okay. Right. Okay, we are uh, moving stuff... Uh, up and down. The elevator's operating now. Okay. Right. Well, that was probably worth looking into. Um, where are we? Uh, okay. We've got a rocket up here that can take off, right? Yeah. Launch. Uh, okay. Uh, we have eight hours left in the cold wave, so after that we're uh, we're pretty much solid for a minute. Uh, right, and we are producing. Yeah, we're producing enough of the uh, the metals. Right now, let's go up here and see about our Martian uh, University. We are producing stuff. Okay. Self-sufficient lighting. Oh, right. I wanted to, uh, I wanted to build a uh, greenhouse uh, gas thing. No, it's over here. A GHG factory. We're gonna put it right. Maybe not there. Um, we can put it right. No. Uh, We'll put it right here. Okay. Uh, that will get the uh, temperature slowly going up, uh, which is what uh, what I want. Because um, we need to get to 50% uh, temperature and 93% atmosphere to open the domes. Uh, and that's kind of the goal, right? And now... Yep, okay, I think that's good. Um, yeah, you know what? I'm going to put the cut here, so that's uh, that's going to be enough. So just uh, mention that I've got a Patreon, the link's in the doobly-doo. So uh, if you want to support the channel, go ahead and do that. Otherwise, uh, see you back next time.